Hey guys, today's video I'm super excited to share with you guys because if you've been following my channel for a while, you guys know come the summertime, I love to decorate my home with the lemon decor. I just love the pop of yellow that it brings to the home. It makes everything look sunny and bright and that's what we need for the summertime. So in today's video, I have some DIYs and some decor ideas that I wanna share with you guys that you can do with lemons and things from Dollar Tree and also some affordable um, items as well from other stores. So if you wanna see how to decorate your home for this summer with lemons then stay tuned to this video so I'm gonna start off by sharing with you guys some lemon signs that I created now in Dollar Tree they have this buffalo check sign that's actually two pieces in one but I wanted to make two signs out of it so I actually separated that top kind of like picture frame part of it um, and I'm gonna put it away and I'm gonna use it later on um, for another you know, lemon sign that I'm gonna make. But for this one, I found this image on Google and I really liked this little lemon sign, but I'm only gonna use like the middle part of it. So I'm just gonna cut around, um, cut the excess off of it and just use the middle part of this you know, printable that I found. And I'm gonna use a glue stick and glue it onto this Buffalo check um, sign that I found at Dollar Tree. For the remaining piece of the sign, I found another image that I liked on Google and I found like it was the perfect size for this frame. And so for this one, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the actual frame around the picture and trace out around the picture to see how much I need to cut. And then I'm gonna actually laminate this picture and then I'm gonna glue it to the back of the frame. And I wanted to laminate it just because, um, I, just in case I need to wipe it or it's good because it's gonna be in my kitchen. If any spills got on it, I wanted to be able to clean this. So I'm gonna use my laminator to laminate it and then glue it to the back. And this is how both signs came out and I think they're really cute. These are gonna go in my kitchen and I made them both for just $1. Moving on to the next sign, you guys have seen this picture frame in my coffee bar because I use it a lot. I switch it out for the holidays and this picture frame is actually from Dollar Tree. So I'm going to add a lemon printable that I actually found on a website, which I will link it down below because this is actually a free printable on her blog. And so she has different sizes of this, um, this lemonade printable and she also has another one too that you guys can print out as well. So I will link that down below. But all I'm going to do is I'm going to take this printable, trace out the picture that I already had for Easter on you know trace it so I can get the exact size and then I'm also going to laminate this one as well because again this is going in my kitchen it's going in the coffee bar area and then I will add it to this picture frame For the next DIY decor sign, I'm gonna make over this wooden mason jar that I found at Dollar Tree during the Christmas time. And it has some of this glitter writing on it. So the first thing I'm gonna do before I can paint it is I'm gonna take some sandpaper and I'm gonna sand off all the glitter writing. Then I'm gonna go in with some white paint and only paint below where you have that little string at because I wanna keep the look of the jar, like the lid and the little string, like the twine on it. So I'm gonna paint everything white below it. And this is how it looks once the white paint is dry before I add my little printable. And the printable that I found for this one, I actually found it on Google as well. And I put it on PicMonkey and I shaped it into a circle shape because I wanted it to look like a little circle on top of this mason jar. So I'm just gonna cut this one out and then I'm gonna use a glue stick as well to glue it on to the front of this little wooden mason jar. So before I share with you guys the DIY decor ideas that I made, I wanted to share with you guys the different lemons that I have and where you guys can find them because I know they are hard to find, especially lately. So I wanted to share with you guys where I found mine. These little ones that I'm holding right now, I found them at Walmart a while back for 97 cents. And then these bigger ones are the ones that come at Dollar Tree, but it's very hard to find them. And Dollar Tree does have some that come three to a pack, but I have yet to find that in my stores. 
and then they also have these little ones right here that i found at the target dollar spot a while back they also have this type of design in oranges as well and then i was super excited this year to find these bags of lemon at hobby lobby and normally i wouldn't buy things at hobby lobby because they tend to be more expensive but they had all of the lemon decor 50% off guys and I think they still have it going on right now so this big bag right here you get six of the big lemons and they're normally priced for $9.99 but because I got it 50% off because of the sale I only paid $4.99 for them and you get six of the big lemons which makes it cheaper than the ones that I bought at Dollar Tree because they were each you know one for a dollar so this was a better deal than Dollar Tree and even a better deal than Walmart and then they also had this small bag of you know mini lemons which i thought was a great deal as well because they come in different sizes and i'm able to decorate different things in my home with the smaller lemons because some of the decor pieces that i wanted to use i needed smaller lemons for so this bag was perfect so original price was 6.99 but i actually got it for 3.99 guys so it was a oh actually i think it was uh 350 actually 349 but it was a great deal because you get so many of the mini lemons inside them and then i saw these lemon picks which i thought was so cute as well which normally i wouldn't be into but i've been seeing a lot of people use them and so i definitely wanted to try them this year and i haven't seen dollar tree have any of these types of picks before again the original price would be 3.99 but i got it for half off so it was um 2.99 or yeah it was yeah i can't do my math right now but yeah it was half price of that but it was a good deal and so i just wanted to share with you guys the lemons that i'm going to be using and now let's go back into the video and show you guys the crafts so if you guys have been following my channel, you guys know that I love to use the mini crates that they have at Dollar Tree to create so many different DIYs for the season and for the holidays. So I'm taking this little mini crate, which is actually the bigger of the two, and I'm going to revamp it. This is the one that I use during Christmas time. So I like to reuse my craft so I'm not wasting money. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to repaint it and I'm going to paint it completely white. And then I'm going to add some letter stickers to it. And the only thing that I'm going to write on it is just lemons. I didn't want to do anything too fancy. I just wanted to write lemons on it. But you can do farm fresh lemons, fresh lemons, whatever you want to do. But I want it to be real simple and just write lemons. And then Dollar Tree has another mini crate. This is the smaller one of the two. And I actually like the look of the natural of this one. So I decided I wasn't going to paint it. I was just going to leave it just like that. And then I wanted to keep it really light and just, you know, add white stickers to it so again I wrote lemons on this one as well and I it's really light but I like the look of it and then I just added the mini lemons to both of these little mini crates and they are so cute and I can't wait to use them in my tear tray and in my kitchen This silver basket I've had for a while now and I found it at Walmart and it actually came two for $1.50. But you can actually find the same type of basket in gold at Dollar Tree right now. But I wanted to give it like a farmhouse style makeover. So what I did was I spray painted it black because anytime I see these type of baskets when it comes to farmhouse style decor, they're always black. So I spray painted mine black. And then to decorate it, all I did was I added the large lemons and a little, uh, some leaves to it because I wanted to add a touch of greenery. Because anytime you see any of my decor pieces, I always like to add a touch of greenery especially when it comes with the yellows and this is so cute it will go perfect in the kitchen and i can't wait to use it in my kitchen and then i also took a tray that i found at dollar tree that i actually hauled to you guys during christmas time this is such a sturdy tray and i love the red color that it had and i used one for the christmas time and then i kept one so that i could spray paint it white because i knew i was going to do a farmhouse style decor later on in the future which is this one so i spray painted it white and then i wanted to add a touch of greenery as well to this before i added any lemons to it and this greenery I found at Walmart for 97 cents and it's like the longer kind of dangly leafy um, greenery and then I just laid it on the tray um, opposites of each other and then I added lemons to them I also added some baby's breath to this as well to add a little touch of white and this actually came out cuter than I expected For the next three decor ideas, I'm going to share with you guys different ways that you can use and style these lemon picks. Now Dollar Tree has so many different vases in their stores, but I found this vase recently that I think is so cute and so farmhouse that I feel like it will go perfect with these little lemon um, picks and you can use one of them inside it and leave it as is and it looks really cute. Or you could spray paint it white and give it a more of a milk jug farmhouse feel, but either way it will look gorgeous in the kitchen. And then Dollar Tree also had these big huge vases that I picked 
picked up a while back it came in black it came in white and then it came in this beautiful navy blue which I feel that navy blues or any color blues go really good with yellows so I think this pairs well together and you can use this in the kitchen as well in your living room in the dining room anywhere I just feel like this piece right here can be so versatile and go anywhere in your home but my favorite way to decorate these lemon picks and the way that I'm gonna use it is with this Bella Mason jar that I found at Dollar General for $6. And I shared it with you guys in my Dollar General haul. I was super excited to find this because in any other store, this thing would go for like 20 bucks. And it's so beautiful. And I feel like the light blues, which is my favorite color, goes great with yellows. And so I love how these little lemon picks look in this big Bella Mason jar. It looks so beautiful. It's perfect for the kitchen, of course course and it pairs so well with the little basket that I made and you will definitely see these two things pair together in my kitchen when I give you guys my home tour this next decor idea you guys is my favorite one to share with you guys and I can't wait to put it in my kitchen so right now Dollar Tree has these water containers that come in three different colors they come in this white they come in blue and they come in red for the you know the 4th of July season they have all the Memorial Day stuff and the 4th of July stuff that I kind of hauled to you guys in my Dollar Tree haul well I picked up the white one and I decided I was gonna make a lemonade pitcher so I filled it up with the larger lemons and then I was also gonna add a little um, leaf to it to add a little touch of greenery like I always do and then you could if you wanted to add more yellow to this like if you really wanted to go with the yellow theme you could spray paint the spout and the lid yellow and make it all yellow but I like to add that touch of white so I kept the white color to it and I think this came out so cute guys look at this is so gorgeous it looks like a little lemonade stand and I can't wait to put it in my kitchen you will see it on my tear tray in my kitchen and I'm just this is like my favorite one out of all the DIYs I'm sharing with you guys today and of course, if I'm gonna create a lemonade pitcher decor, I have to have some cute lemonade cups, right? So when we think of lemonade in summertime, people always think of like the mason jars. And Dollar Tree has these cute little mason jars right now that they always have them in stock, so you'll always find them at Dollar Tree. And so I picked up a couple and I put, I just filled them up with the little lemons. And then I found these little straws at Dollar General for $1.25. And it comes with like green, the light blue, and then yellow straws that have like the little lemon to them so you have a variety of colors that you could use but of course I like to pair the yellow and the blue together so I am putting a blue straw in mine and this will also go in my tear tray um, that you will see in my kitchen it's gonna be in my coffee bar so it's not gonna be a coffee bar this summer it's gonna be a lemonade stand and so these little mason jar lemonade mason jars will go with the lemonade pitcher Another way that you can decorate with lemons is by taking this little clear container that they have in the party wedding section at Dollar Tree. It's me it shows that it's meant to hold gumballs, but you guys have seen me use it um, during the holiday time. I put a bunch of Christmas balls in there and used it for Christmas decor. So I love using it for the different seasons and the different themes because you can fill it up with whatever you're decorating with and just let it go for that season. So since I'm into the lemon decor, I decided to fill it up with little lemons. And then of course, you know, I had to add a little bit of touch of greenery. And then again, this makes a perfect lemon decor that can go in your kitchen in your dining room um, even in your living room wherever you like it's just another way to style your lemons in your home another thing that you can do is put your lemons in a pretty bowl I got this bowl from Dollar Tree and Dollar Tree has so many beautiful bowls and plates in their store so this is another decor idea that you can do for your kitchen with the lemons and then another way you could decorate with your lemons is by putting your lemons in a farmhouse style scale I created this one on my channel about two years ago with Dollar Tree products and I made it for less than five dollars so if you want to see that video I'll put it in the description box below so you can recreate it because it looks so well with the lemons and I also created this farmhouse style scale as well on my channel again with the Dollar Tree products and I put lemons on it as well and I use these scales throughout the years with the different type of decor pieces when it comes to the holidays but they look gorgeous with the lemons so I will definitely have those videos down below for you guys if you want to check it out so that is um, it for today's video you guys I hope you guys enjoyed it I had so much fun 
creating and coming up with different type of decor ideas um, to decorate with lemons. I mean, there's so many more ways to decorate with lemons, but these were just the ways that I came up with for you guys. And I didn't want this to be such a long video, so I kind of cut some stuff out. So just follow me on Instagram because I'll be sharing more uh, ways to decorate with lemons on my Instagram, like little ways that you can use different things in the home to decorate with lemons. So definitely follow me on Instagram if you're not following me already. And I will catch you guys in my next video and stay tuned for that tour where I'll show you how I decorate with these in my house. Hey guys, don't forget to click on the picture in the middle of the screen so you can subscribe to my channel and get notifications on all the new videos that I put out. And check out these other two videos that I have posted on my channel on either side of my picture. Have a great day.